So here we have this uh, little fellow here, the god Shulao, and this is an exceptional piece. It had quite some history. It is uh, here published in the Eumorphopoulos, um, and uh, then again it was at auction uh, at Sotheby's in 1940s. It was in the possession of George Eumorphopoulos, one of the most important collectors of Chinese ceramics, and then also in the collection of Queen Maria of Yugoslavia, another noted collector of Chinese art. It also has this nice label here. Generally uh, speaking, this is from the Song Dynasty, 12th to 13th century, and it's a Ding Wei. And this is uh, quite unusual because uh, it is extremely rare to find a figural subject with a white glaze that comes from the northern kilns. Uh, most uh, that you can find are from Jing De Jen, so this is then Qing Bai, of course, and, and Long Quan. A couple of years ago, a, a Ding fragment of a seated figure, also from the Northern Song Dynasty, uh, was sold at Sotheby's, uh, that which was excavated together with the head of an Arhat at the Ding Kiln site. So it's proven that Ding made these pieces. Uh, of course, this is a recent excavation, so it was not known when Armophopoulos published it, which is why at the time it was catalogued as Song Dynasty, but Jiangxi or Jiangsu provenance, so uh, completely different to what we know uh, today. Uh, there is another Ding figure which was sold at Sotheby's uh, London in 1977 and a few other examples in museums. And then there is this uh, legendary Ding Yao boy a pillow from uh, the Northern Song Dynasty, which sold for half a million euro. And, and here we have Shu Lao, which has a, a beautiful wear and patina like many ancient or confirmed ancient Ding pieces have. Uh, it has this beautiful ivory glaze, which is so typical for the kiln. And, uh, and this beautiful luster, and it's in superb condition. It has, of course, some, some kiln flaws, but otherwise is, is absolutely excellent. And for this reason, uh, and with this background, of course, extremely rare. Uh, we put it at a, a reasonable price at 4,000 euros only. I think this is, uh, uh, is almost a joke, but um, I'm sure it will do well, but still a good chance to acquire a decent piece of ancient ceramic in our upcoming sale. And uh, I wish you good luck in bidding.